Hi, people. We hope you're having an amazing day today. Since the pandemic forced us to stay at home for almost two years straight, we feel like our preferences in our lives have changed dramatically. Suddenly, we found ourselves creating open landscapes, village life, and peaceful atmospheres. Because it was just a dream to achieve all these, for the most part, we found the cure in watching some small-town dramas that depict life in those faraway lands perfectly. Of course, it's only the resemblance of what it would be like to live in a cozy place. But still, we feel like it's better than nothing to experience this through some beloved characters of ours. Thus, we made sure to pick a series with clever plots and unique characters so that we can identify with the show and its cast more easily. In search of such a show, we came across Virgin River, a series that manages to combine all these in a single show. Adapted by the long novel series by Robin Carr, Virgin River is the perfect show with a cozy small town atmosphere. Even though the book series follows multiple characters and the main protagonists shift in time, the series is exclusively focusing on Mel and Jack's love story so far. The couple's relationship is both perfect and terrible at the same time. On the one hand, it's amazing because they are clearly in love with each other and share a very angsty romance. However, on the other hand, neither of them acts logically enough to preserve this romance. Instead, they act selfishly, make nonsense decisions, and risk losing their love all the time. So we find ourselves in limbo. While we support the two and want to see them together, we also want to make sure that they prioritize each other over everyone and everything, which is something we have yet to see. The worst thing is, it's likely for the show to go in the exact opposite direction in Season 4, as more drama is loading for both Mel and Jack. Even though Jack's newly found ex-wife is considered as possibly the biggest concern for the next season by many, we believe that there is an even bigger threat to Mel and Jack's relationship, the possibility of Mel having a baby from someone else. We all know that Mel is pregnant, which is both magical and amazing. However, we also know that she isn't sure who the father of her baby is, since Jack didn't support her in her dream of having a baby during the majority of their relationship, she had to apply her other options to achieve her dream. So she decided to utilize the frozen sperms of her late husband. Now, even though Jack returned with full support, it's uncertain whether the baby is from him or not. In our opinion, Jack will react very harshly to the fact that Mel used her late husband's sperms. Thus, even though the baby is likely to belong to Jack, we don't think Mel will allow him to be a part of the process. Instead, they are likely to be separated, to the point that Jack might even return to his ex. Speaking on the new season, Martin Henderson, who plays Jack, said the following, I can't tell you too much because it'll give it away, but you find out what's going on. I'm just going to say that season 4 reveals and answers all the questions but then presents some more. I think season 4 is going to be really satisfying for people because of that giant cliffhanger. There were multiple cliffhangers, which gives a little love-hate situation for the audience where they love but hate the weight. It's going to be worth it, because the writers really answer that stuff. I think people will be satisfied. Are you ready to welcome Virgin River Season 4? Let us know what you think in the comments below and don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.